Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. Welcome to another Animal Crossing New Horizon guide. And in this video, we're going to go over all of the bugs, fish, and deep sea creatures you can find coming to the game in May. This of course is only going to go over Northern Hemisphere animals. And if you find this video helpful, do leave a like down below and let's get started. Starting off with the fish, we're actually starting off with an amphibian. The frog is going to be the first animal that is new in May, can be found in ponds with a small shadow all day long and sells for 120 bells. Next is the catfish with a medium large shadow found from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. in ponds and sells for 800 bells. The nibble fish is going to be a tiny shadow found in rivers from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. and sells for 1,500 bells. The angel fish is going to be a small shadow found in rivers from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and sells for 3,000 bells. The beta is going to be the small shadow found in rivers from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. and sells for 2,500 bells. Next is the rainbow fish. This little guy has a tiny shadow found from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. found in rivers and sells for 800 bells. Next, we have two very large fish that are somewhat hard to find. First being the giant trevally. This is going to be a large shadow only found in the ocean off the pier on your island. It can be found all day long and sells for 4,500 bells. Next, the Mahi Mahi is going to again be a large shadow only found off the pier in the ocean on your island all day long but sells for 6,000 bells. Now May is going to be your last chance to grab a couple fish because after the month is over, these fish will be leaving. The first is going to be the loach. This is going to be a small shadow found in rivers all day long and sells for 400 bells. The golden trout is a difficult one to find, so do save up on your fish bait. Going to be a medium to small shadow found from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and only found in rivers on cliff tops. That's going to be any elevation above the ground elevation on your island, and it sells for 15,000 bells. The last fish leaving at the end of May is going to be the oar fish. This one has a huge shadow found in the sea all day long and sells for 9,000 bells. Next, we have our bugs. In the month of May, there are a lot of bugs that are available, but only a small number of new and leaving bugs. So the first new bug coming in the month of May is going to be the Great Purple Emperor Butterfly. This one is going to be found flying all over your island from 4 a.m to 7 p.m. and sells for 3,000 bells. The Queen Alexandra's Birdwing Butterfly is going to be found flying all over your island from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. and sells for 4,000 bells. Also flying around your island is going to be the Banded Dragonfly. This one's going to be a little hard to find because Darner Dragonflies are absolutely everywhere. But this guy can be found from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and sells for 4,500 bells. The Pond Skater can be found running around on the top of any fresh water from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. and sells for 130 bells. These guys are everywhere. You won't have any problem finding them. The diving beetle is going to be swimming around in fresh water from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. and sells for 800 bells. The violin beetle is going to be found on tree stumps all day long and sells for 450 bells. The Rosalia Badesi beetle, I believe I said that right, is on tree stumps all day long and sells for 3,000 bells. And the last new bug coming to the game is not actually a bug, but the scorpion can be found running around on the ground from 7 p.m. to 4 a.m. This one sells for 8,000 bells. You're going to want to treat this one a lot like we treated the tarantula. Don't run around with your net out because if it sneaks up on you, it will run over and sting you. Find one, then sneak up on it with your net once you have it in sight. The only bug leaving at the end of May 
cricket. Thank goodness is the mole cricket. If you're looking for any other bug, this guy messes with the bug table on your island and their noise can get pretty annoying. So they are leaving at the end of May. They're found underground all day long and they sell for 500 bells. Last but certainly not least, let's go ahead and talk about our deep sea creatures. We have a few that are new in the month of May, starting with the sea urchin. This is going to be a small, slow shadow found all day long and sells for 1,700 bells. The next is going to be the Slate Pencil Urchin. This is going to be a medium shadow moving at medium speed, found from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and sells for 2,000 bells. The Gigas Giant Clam is a huge shadow that moves pretty quick, can be found all day long, and sells for 15,000 bells. This one is a bit of a difficult one to find, so it might take you a while. The Vampire Squid is going to be a medium shadow with very quick movements, found from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and sells for 10,000 bells. The spotted garden eel is going to be a small, slow-moving shadow found from 4 a.m. to 9 p.m. and it sells for 1,100 bells. After the month of May, the turban shell is going to be leaving us. It has a small, slow shadow found all day long and sells for 1,000 bells. The Umbrella Octopus will also be leaving at the end of May with a small but fast moving shadow found all day long and sells for 6,000 bells. And then the Dungeness Crab is a medium shadow moving at medium speed found all day long and sells for 1,900 bells. And that's it. All of the bugs, fish, and deep sea creatures you can expect to find in the month of May in Animal Crossing New Horizon. If you found this video helpful, please do leave a like down below. Comment what your favorite bug, fish, or deep sea creature is. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope it was helpful. And until next time, I will talk at you in the next video. Bye.